learning about the fruit of the Spirit. The fruit of the Spirit isn't what you're thinking of, Lily. What do you mean, Mommy? When we follow Jesus, the Holy Spirit works to make us more like Jesus. There, we start having the fruits of the Spirit living in us, like love, joy and peace. You may be thinking, what are the fruits of the Spirit? The fruits of the Spirit are love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness and self-control. Today we are going to be learning about love. So Lily, think of someone that loves you lots and lots. Mommy. <laughs> So we make mistakes and it doesn't matter as Jesus still loves us and God loves us too. He can help us love others the way we should. So should we go into a time of worship Lily? Yeah! Let's do this. See you in a bit. in me help me to love like you love me even when i want to go my own way jesus you make me strong no i won't give up even when it's tough i'm gonna shine my light for you yes i will do good and i will be I'm gonna shine my light for you I'll shine for you Lord, I'll be patient And I will share So others see How much you care Even when I want to go my own way Jesus, you Make me strong No, I won't give up Even when it's tough I'm gonna shine my light for you Yes, I will do good And I will be kind I'm gonna shine my light for you I'll shine for you I'll shine for you I'll shine for you I'll shine for you I'm gonna shine my light for you Yes, I will do good And I will be kind I'm gonna shine my light for you No, I won't give up Even when it's tough I'm gonna shine my light for you Yes, I will do good And I will be kind I'm gonna shine my light for you I'll shine 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 for you not a coconut fruit of the spirit's not a coconut if you want to be a coconut you might as well hear it you can't be a fruit of the spirit cause the fruit is love joy peace patience kindness goodness faithfulness and gentleness and self-control love joy peace patience kindness goodness faithfulness and gentleness and self-control oh the fruit of the spirit's not a banana the fruit of the spirit's not a banana 
you wanna be a banana, you might as well hear it. You can't be a fruit of the spirit, cause the fruit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Oh, the fruit of the spirit's not a watermelon. The fruit of the spirit's not a watermelon. If you wanna be a watermelon, you might as well hear it. You can't be a fruit of the spirit, cause the fruit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Oh, the fruit of the spirit's not a lemon. The fruit of the spirit's not a lemon. If you wanna be a lemon, you might as well hear it. You can't be a fruit of the spirit, cause the fruit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Oh, the fruit of the spirit's not a cherry. The fruit of the spirit's not a cherry. If you wanna be a cherry, you might as well hear it. You can't be a fruit of the spirit, cause the fruit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Okay, everybody knows that grapes come in bunches, so everybody get in big bunches. The fruit of the spirit's not a grape. The fruit of the spirit's not a grape. You wanna be a grape? You might as well hear it. You can't be a fruit of the spirit, cause the fruit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. The fruit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Love and joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness, and self-control. Slapstick Theater. John's letter about love. This is John. Hey there. John was a disciple of Jesus. He heard Jesus' teaching. Huh, hi, eh? And saw how much Jesus loved people. Wow. John spent the rest of his life telling others about Jesus. John wrote letters to people who believed in Jesus to encourage them and teach them. Hmm. In one of his letters, he wrote about real love. He said that we know what real love is because Jesus gave up his life for us, so we should do the same for others. If someone has enough money to live well, and sees another in need but doesn't help. Uh, fair. Yeah. How can God's love really be in that person? John said, let's not merely say that we love each other, but let's show our love for people through our actions. Hey, kids! Lily, what do we have here? We sure do, we have an empty cup. And this empty cup represents the emptiness in our hearts without Jesus. Right, Lily, I would like you to pour some red colouring dye into the cup. Guys, anything can happen. Ah, that's it. Go and keep putting a bit more. Pouring up. That's it. So, <coughs> Jesus died on the cross to pay the price for our sins because he loves us so much. Right, Lily, let's put some baking soda into the cup. That's it. Whoa! Lovely. <laughs> so, <laughs> when we give our hearts to Jesus, he washes it clean and gives you and I the Holy Spirit to help follow him. So, he loves us and he loves other people. So Lily, carefully pour the vinegar into the cup. That's it. Just not in your eyes. Yeah, it's open, not in your sprinkle it. <laughs> Do you want me to help you? That's it, keep going. That's it. Oh, can we see it fizzing, guys? Oh, that's, that's it. Because he first loved us, 
that's the Holy Spirit at work in our hearts and it bubbles off inside and causes his love to overflow out of our hearts and show love to others. Did we have fun today Lil? Yeah! <laughs> so now we're going to go to our memory verse. See you later guys! a memory verse first. So today's memory verse is Mark verse 12, 30. So love the Lord your God with all your heart. So love is a command from God. There are so many ways we can show love to people all around. I want us all to think of a little bit now. How can we show love this week to the people in our lives? Life looks a little bit different now for us all. So we all need to show each other love and respect. I hope we all have an awesome week and we'll see you next week. God bless. <laughs>